how are ya? Alright, today, um, I, I had really bad breaks here, you can still see, see it right here and here. Um, September when I cut my nails and I shouldn't have cut my nails, causes my nails to splinter. Because, I don't know, this hand's like really thick. So anyways, I filed off the gel that was on here, the clear gel, most of it. Um, took down the link, kind of reshaped it, because my nails grow so from way down under and if I don't relieve the pressure it starts cutting into the skin it hurts it it, it really hurts especially my thumb so yeah the shape's a little bit wonky oh look at these these are these are a hot mess so because I love this color so much which is pivot from uh Madame Glam I'm gonna use that so yeah so I thought I'd just do my nails and um make sure I dehydrate them real quick hold on Alright, that's done. I'm just going to add a little bit of protein on. This stuff works good. I never get lifting on my nails. I had to, I didn't have to cut them. It was just taking me forever to file them down when we first got fluky. And it was, you know, like fall cleaning. You had to pull the ACs out of the window, all that jazz. And, um, to put this in there <laughs> with the, the lamp that's just right on top of that. You can see what I'm like. Hey guys, I just wanted to touch base with you because I was rambling big time. I wasn't even finishing a thought in this video. I was talking through the whole damn thing. I was slow as a sloth. And uh, yeah, so it, it was a mess, like verbally a mess. And I was very slow. So. Um, I'm just doing, I really like that color pivot, so I wanted to see if I could put it on my nails and live with it, because I really don't like, I would rather have a clear overlay than a color, if that makes sense. So I'm just putting a scrubbed in coat of Madame Glam's base coat here. And then I'll go in with the with pivot, and I was back on back and forth really a lot when I was putting the color on, thinking, oh God, does it look different on this hand? Is this hand lighter than the other? <laughs> like I was struggling big time with the color, but in the end I ended up liking it. So I just wanted to touch base with you guys because I haven't really talked. I haven't been really. I only doing like one video a week. But look at this color. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Um, Alright, so that's what I'm talking about. Squirrel moments. Um, so I want to know what y'all doing for Thanksgiving. Are you cooking? Are you going somewhere? Are you getting takeout and just relaxing? Um, are you ready for the holidays? Holiday manis, which I'm really not a big fan of. Um, I mean, they're nice when other people do them. <laughs> I just don't like doing them. Like, I don't mind, like, one or two, but after that, it gets, like, really redundant for me. And, yeah, so, we're pretty much set for the holidays. We're not doing anything for Thanksgiving. We never do. It's just a big, huge waste of a holiday for me. Anyways, you know, my son lives in Texas. I'm in Massachusetts. My daughter's in, like, 45 minutes. If the... I could probably get to her house in 20 minutes if there's no uh, traffic. Seems like we get home quicker. So I'm just checking to see, do I like this color? Do I like it? So yeah, we're staying home for Thanksgiving. Um, we just sent money out to my daughter and my son for the kids for Christmas. They can, you know, buy what they need, help with, you know, Santa Claus, uh, they don't need anything right now, get groceries, do whatever you need with it, but here's some money, certain amount per child, everybody got the same thing, nobody's loved more than another, or anything like that, um, we might go to my daughter's if my car is running alright, um, Christmas Day, just to see the kids. Um, maybe stop and get some donuts or something, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, 
not really big into the big holiday things. Um, seems like the older I get, like the farther away I get from holidays. And yeah, it's just not very good memories of holiday seasons from being a kid, so I just don't really care for it. But other than that, I want to know what you're doing. Let me know down below what you're going to do. And yeah, now I'm just going to finish off the hand. Now that I, I did the thumb completely first and had that done. Then I'm going to encapsulate the this with a builder gel to make sure, you know, it's all good. So it looks a little wonky right now. Um, so I'm thinking about having a little giveaway after the holiday, after the holiday season is over. Um, you know, just, I'm not announcing it. It's not going to be in my, in the title or anything. It'll just be like a random giveaway, just sporadic. And just to give back to those who actually do watch me. Like I, I, like, I appreciate everybody that watches me, but I'm really not here to teach you anything. <laughs> I don't feel like I'm a content creator or anything like that. I'm just trying to do some nail designs and or just basically literally trying to do my own nails sometimes. And I record it. It's just my journey. And it's a very late in life journey to start. Um... So, yeah, I appreciate you guys for just hanging around and sticking with me while I continue to go through this. I don't ever plan on being an expert in anything or having anything knocked out. I don't know why I was turning my hand over like this. I like to turn my just my finger upside down and I have the finger pointing at me so I can see it. But you'll see I'll do that with this finger, I think. Maybe I do it with my thumb. I don't know. I think I do it with this finger. I bend it the opposite way so I can actually see it like that. So I can see underneath the nail if it's, you know, floated into the right spot. So it just progressively speeds up. And, um, yeah, so I just wanted to say thank you and touch base. So let me know what your plans are for the holidays. Um, if there's anything you want me to try, let me know. I don't know how long I'm going to stick with this. I think I might. I kind of enjoy doing, before I was really about doing it on camera so I could physically look back and see where I saw my mistakes. But I find that I'm struggling more to stay in shot. That's, you know, like, um, because I'm doing it on my own hand. It's not on a stand where it's just going to stay right there on the stand. It's on my own hand and sometimes I, for me to do something, I pulled out Madame Glam. Uh, it was too loose. I like, really like this base coat. I love, not base coat, top coat. I put the thinnest amount and you can feel it grabbing a hold of the, the nail. This thinnest, thinnest amount. And I'll use that brush, like the amount that's on that brush for all four nails until I get to the thumb. Oh, it's awesome. It came from Russia. But yeah, so see so squirrel moment. I don't even know what the hell I was talking about. Yeah, so sometimes I feel like I'm just struggling to stay in shot and I can't get myself in the position that allows me to do what I need to do or want to do. So that's like kinda why I've slowed down to like once a week. Um, I don't know how long I'll keep on with it. I just don't know. I think I'd rather just, sometimes I just have days I just want to do my nails and have it come out decent and just post like a picture on Instagram. Um, I don't like really promote myself very well. Um, I post one picture and that, I post more pictures of a cat than I do, <laughs> do of nails. Um, so yeah, I don't know. You know, I think I'll, I don't know. I'm on the fence. Maybe half and half. One video and then one just for, like, to do my nails and be able to turn my hands the way I need them. If I need them up in my face, they can be up in my face. And, 
Yeah, so now my hands are, kill are killing me. They are so dry, so freaking dry. Um, they're cracking, they're starting to bleed. So I am going to, as soon as I'm done wipe, wiping everything down, I didn't put any of this on yet. I use that for night. I'm going to put some cuticle oil on, some hyaluronic acid serum, and a hand cream. But when I, when I looked at the ingredients, I saw there was water in it. I'm like, damn it. <laughs> no, I need just cream cream. Like a thick cream salve for my hands. Because I don't even know why the pinky is doing that. So yeah, I'm just giving my hands some love. After they've had their ass kicked. And uh, yeah. So I, don't, I think that in the end... I was happy with them. I was on the fence the whole time through the video, just wondering. So, I don't know, you tell me, Does, do they look decent? I, I, I kind of like the color, I think I can live with it. I think I can live with it. So, thanks for joining me, and bye! Have a good day, and remember, like, subscribe, don't you to be crap. Bye!